Hi friends, welcome to a new series of videos uh, that is called Typical Mistakes We Do in Dog Training. And in this series, we will show typical mistakes that our dogs do and typical mistakes that the dog handler does. And we will try to show what the mistake is and how we can fix the mistakes. Um, these mistakes are mistakes that we did as trainers by ourselves. And these are mistakes that we watch as a trainer, what mistakes other people do while they train their dogs. The first example I will show you is the dog is in the starting position, it's right next to us in the heel position, and uh, the dog's looking to us normally, and we start walking. So if the dog's distracted and is looking somewhere else and I start walking, the dog's not paying attention to us and we walk alone and the dog's still sitting there and looking at the bird or whatever. The second example I will show you is making the U-turn. So you just walk, 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 your dog's paying attention. Now there's a bird or a rabbit and the dog's looking uh, away from us and we do our U-turn and the dog's not paying attention. So the dog will not go with us in turn. So these are the two examples I will show you today. And we will start uh, with the first example and I'm gonna get my dog and show you how it's done. So right now we're on the training field and uh, the first thing we need from the dog to work is his attention. So you see the dog's distracted by something else. And uh, right now I'm just trying to get his attention. Floki, Fuß. So with him, he's experienced, he's, uh, it's, it's easy. I would say it's easy because he knows the commands very well. And as soon as I give him a command, normally he's uh, with me. Fuß. So now you see the dog's easily distracted by everything else because he's a little bit weak nerved. But when he pays attention to me, I wait, I reward that. So now we try uh, with our uh, cameraman, we try uh, to do a little bit of uh, distractions and to show you how it looks when the dog is not paying attention and I start walking. You see, now the dog's distracted and I start walking and the dog's not walking with me. Show you again one more time. Fuß, tell him the command. The dog's looking and I start walking. So you see, the dog's walking with me, but um, the dog's not looking at me. So this is a typical mistake people make, or I did by myself, uh, not waiting till the dog's paying attention to us and then we start walking. So now I'm gonna show you how this should look. Fuß. Now the cameraman is doing again a little bit distractions. Fuß. And then we start walking. And now we can reward that. When the dog's paying attention to us, we will reward that. So that's a typical mistake people make. The dog has a command, for example, Fuß. Dog has to sit right next to us and look at us. And when the dog's distracted by the cameraman or by other people, and we start walking and the dog will not pay attention, look at other things, and we start walking alone, or the dog's not paying attention while walking. So right now I'm gonna try and show you the next mistake by, by the U-turn. So I give him the command, Fuß. We start walking. And then now the dog's a little bit over-motivated. Now you see the dog did not pay attention and I wanted to make the U-turn and it was a complete catastrophe. So we try it one more time. Fuß. We start, we start walking. And normally it should look like this. Dog's paying attention at us and it's turning with us in the U-turn. So I'm trying to show you one more time with distractions. Fuß. So you see the dog's a little bit over motivated today. Fuß. So we walk, we walk, then. Looking, looking. Hey, swing. So now you see the dog was not 100% with me. 
so it was not turning uh, very nice. So now the dog's looking at me and I can make my U-turn. So this is how it should be. The dog's not distracted, dog's with us. And now the dog's again a little bit distracted by something. So I'll try to do it starting over one more time. Fuss, we walk, dog's paying attention. So we walk, the dog's paying attention and we do our U-turn one more time. So now uh, the dog did a good U-turn. The U-turns before were not so good. So this is why I did not reward the dog. But uh, right now we're in training and uh, that's why we're training for. Not everything, even if the dog knows the exercise very well, goes perfect. Um, that's also why we're training and we also want to show you that we're also not perfect, our dogs are not perfect, but that's why we're training for. So just train, go over, go over again, over the exercise and only reward when the exercise is like you wanted to do, uh, to, like you wanted to have it. So that's why I did it a few times till it was a good U-turn and that's what I rewarded. Yeah, if you're interested in the video series, um, subscribe to my channel, like the video, and if you have any questions, just write it down in the comments and we will have a discussion about your thoughts and my training methods. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for the upcoming videos and we will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Uh,